All right, pretty amazing to see those kinds of images here yeah. in our area. We did have some storms and some rain. The rain came down pretty hard earlier today. I had to put the wipers on the full blast today. Yeah, overnight I was hearing all the thunder and then my husband asked my daughter this morning, did you hear those storms last night? She was like, no, but they were loud. Yeah, so I'm lucky my kids sleep through that because well, I was yeah, awake. Kids sleep soundly. <laughs> they lucky. do, uh, but they were pretty loud and it did give us some beneficial rainfall yeah. and we're starting off our Friday a little bit gloomy, but it does shape up later on and then the weekend looks fantastic much better than what we've actually been dealing with this week. So right now we're at 64 degrees, still a tad bit on the cooler side, but we started off in the upper 50s. We have winds out of the north northwest at about 10 to 15 miles an hour. We'll still struggle to make it to 70 degrees, but by later on we'll see a little bit of sunshine around. We do have a few spotty showers that are still lingering for areas north and also east of Pittsburgh, but that's going to be the trend of these. Most of them by later on this evening, they'll stay to the mostly stay to the east at that, but then by the time we get to tomorrow, we're clear. We're have high pressure build in. We have a lot of sunshine. It'll just be a little bit on the hazy side. So right now on our radar, we just have a spotty shower for places in the southern part of Armstrong County, also into Indiana. A little bit of some heavier downpours too. That's the yellow and orange you're seeing. And then north of I-80 towards Punxsutawney. And then areas off to the west. A spotty shower, but nothing severe expected. Rain totals from last night. A lot of that heavier rain fell south. Just about an inch of rainfall in Washington. Over an inch in Connellsville for today. And then even into Morgantown. Look at Wheeling. All that heavy rain but it did weaken as it moved east. Temperatures right now at 70 in Beaver. We're at 64 in Butler, 66 Irwin, 62 in Catanning. Clary, you're looking at 60 degrees, 68 in Greensburg, and 69 right now in Connellsville. So through this evening, showers do taper off. It looks dry for the Taylor Swift concert tonight. We'll stay mainly cloudy, and then overnight we'll clear out. Temperatures tomorrow morning, we start off into the upper 50s, and then tomorrow we do warm up. We make it back into the mid to upper 70s. So let me time out these showers for you. We'll see a spot showers till about two o'clock and then those move off to the south off to the east and then we'll be clearing out through tonight. No midnight rain expected and then by Saturday gorgeous. We'll have plenty of sunshine around. Even Father's Day looks great and that lasts into Juneteenth. So we're looking at a little bit of some wildfire smoke today, but it's going to be hard to notice because it's cloudy and we still have a little bit of drizzle out there, but then we do start to see that lighten up by the time we get to Saturday. So 55 degrees tonight, mostly cloudy and dry and looking at our 70 forecast 76 partly cloudy on Saturday, maybe a little bit hazy, but still should be a great day. 80 degrees on Sunday and sunny 84 for father 84 80 on Father's Day 84 for Juneteenth and then by Tuesday mid 80s a few showers low 80s on Wednesday and sunny skies on Thursday with highs of the low 80s.